my bills and wish it's hell, it's time to bend me me Bitch, I feel like Yannis, this is finals, I drop a 50 piece Every day I wake up, put it on, he always be digging me I have my niggas spin right now, that's just the key to me What's good YouTube? So I'm back at y'all again with another video in the car. Now this is probably gonna be my last scene in this hot ass car. As y'all know, y'all probably like what the fuck you got a button up on for. I just came for hella interviews today. As y'all know, I am looking for a new gig type shit. I had a lot of shit going on. I fucked my hand up in some more shit. It ain't broke, but it's blue. So I just put me a little ace bandage on type shit. So we finna just jump straight into this video. Yes, this is Copper Drop part four. As y'all know, y'all can follow me on Pinterest. Post your guns, pin your guns, hashtag guns, hashtag TGM. Y'all can follow me right there. So make sure y'all go follow me and tap in. If you're new to my channel, please like, comment, subscribe. We're on the road to 2,000 subscribers. Then we're going to get to 5,000. Next thing you know, we at 10,000. I'm trying to keep shit motivated. Keep shit up on my channel. You know, keep growing type shit. As y'all know, I all right first up we got the funnybeaver.com he has a barrett 50 bmg this bitch is tall as shit big as shit and it looks like he got like a silencer i don't know they're probably just the barrel off the strength just because it's a 50 bmg as y'all know i love 50 cows like i got a 50 cow glock i got a 50 bell wolf like this is probably like my ultimate 50 that i need is a 50 bmg so i'm going to cop it for sure and I'm gonna rate it probably like an 8 out of 10 just because it's all black. But yeah, let's jump straight to the next. Next up, we got my boy Roy Martin. He has some type of bullshit as Markarov. I don't know what the fuck, but it has an 80 round drum and it looked like it's chambered in 380. I'm gonna drop it just because this shit look like my granddaddy carried that shit. I ain't gonna fake, but he got a drum in this shit. That nigga might be dangerous. I ain't even finna fake to you. I'm gonna drop it and rate it probably like a 5 out of 10 on some cool shit. But yeah, let's move on. Alright, next we got Cerakote. It looks like they Cerakoted a Canic TP9. It got like the Deadpool thing. I'm gonna drop the Canic just because I don't like Canics. I've seen and held and shot a Canic before, so I don't like Canic. And I'm gonna probably rate it probably like an 8 out of 10. I do like the Cerakote though. It's definitely hard for sure. But yeah, let's move on to the next. All right, we back at it again with my boy E-Bombs World. Y'all probably be thinking that I'll just be choosing his ass, but if y'all know, if y'all go on Pinterest, all you got to do is scroll and you see everything. So I don't pick nobody. I just randomly scroll and I randomly select. So that's how I do it. If you don't like it, get the fuck off the video. Simple. But back to my boy E-Bombs World. It looks like he has some type of shotgun with a drum magazine. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to cop it. That bitch is fully tacked the fuck out. So we're definitely going to cop for sure. Yeah, and I'm gonna rate this bitch probably like a nine and a half out of 10 because that bitch look fully tacked. So yeah, nine and a half out of 10, cop, let's move on. All right, next up we got Daily Mail, that's they shit. It looks like they has a AR-15, but this bitch gold plated. I ain't gonna fake cop, that bitch is hard. Y'all gonna see it for yourself. It looked like the police seized it from somebody. What the fuck? I don't give a fuck. I'm still copying that shit. But yeah, man, look like a 556 or 223, something like that. Or maybe 762. No, that's 556. Five, yeah. All right, let's move on to the next. It's a cop, and I'm going to rate it 10 out of 10. Next up, we got my boy Esteban Valdez. I'm my bad if I'm saying y'all name or pronouncing y'all name wrong. But look like he got like a 1911, and this bitch is engraved everywhere. I definitely like the Jesus theme. I'm a cop it, rate it nine out of 10, just because it ain't too much, but it got like that little sauce, that little flavor that every 1911 should have. So I'm definitely going to cop it for sure. Let's move on. We got my boy E-Bombs World again. See, they really got some shit for real. It looks like he got like a Glock 19, I want to say, or that might not be a 19. I really don't know, but he got like the, it's a Nintendo zapper and they got like some dirt it's a dura glock on the mag that's some silly ass shit i'ma rate it nine and a half out of ten just because this like some unique weird shit and it's cool it's different it ain't too much but it's too much type shit and i'ma cop it for sure again shout out my boy e-bombs world let's move on next up we got yeshua visuals i don't know if i'm saying that right but it look like he got a glock 19 with some Flicks, flocks, whatever how the fuck you say that shit. It got a comp. 
We got the flashlight, Holosun, and some type of whatever the fuck on the back of it. I don't know too much about that shit on Glocks, but I'm definitely going to cop it just because it looked like some Call of Duty ass shit. And I'ma rate it probably like eight out of 10 just because it's all black. It ain't too much, it's simple, calm, plain. And yeah, shout out my boy Yeshua. Let's move on. All right, y'all, we got my boy Michael Ken Cannon. I don't know how the fuck that's how you said, but he has a Glock 26 nine millimeter and it looked like it's chrome dipped and it got like a little stitching. He definitely upgraded the sights. He got like the green in the front and then the red in the back. I definitely like how it look. I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10 and I'm definitely gonna cop because it's definitely like, it remind me of the Glock 30, how small it is. So I'm definitely going to cop. I love how Glock 30s feel, how small, how chunky it is so yeah nine out of ten in the cop let's move on shout out my boy michael all right next up we got my boy philip wright he has a little selection going on at the top it looks like uh i don't know what the fuck that is but it looks like a little pocket rocket slash putting your sock type gun i definitely a cop it because some small little, that's some shit you would like you know go to the mailbox take out the trash some cool little shit you know I don't know what type of gun it is, but I'm definitely a cop it. Now, rating wise, I'll give it a probably like a good five out of 10, just because I don't know what the fuck it is. Next up, we got a grayish, red, and black Glock. I don't know what type of Glock it is. I'm going to cop it. Rated wise, I'm gonna probably give it like a seven out of 10, just because it ain't too much, but you definitely see the color and it definitely pop. Next up, we got, I don't know what it is. I'll cop it for sure but rating wise i give it a good five i don't like that earth green dark green doodle green i don't like that shit i ain't gonna fake and then last and final at the bottom he got like a american flag fourth of july type theme it ain't too much but you can see it type shit it's just like a little hint of it but he definitely left like that black character and then it like he got a mag flare at the bottom it got the bean back plate yeah, I definitely get this one probably like an eight and a half out of ten, and I definitely a cop. Shout out my boy Philip. Let's move on to the next. Next we got my boy Ziggy Marley. He has three pistols. One of them look like a uh, Smith and Wesson. The other two is Glocks, but I love. All right, so look, as y'all know, I don't fuck with the Smith and Wessons, but this Smith and Wesson, this bitch low key hard. So I'm going to take this in consideration. I'm definitely going to cop this one just because how it looks, how the theme is, the camo, it got the, it got the hollow sand, it got the light, it def, and like the grip, the stitching is definitely fire, so. All right, YouTube, back to Ziggy Marley. I definitely would cop all three rating wise. I'm going to give it a eight out of 10 for the Smith & Weston, and in the Glocks, I definitely would give it a seven out of 10 and a nine out of 10, just because I don't know what type of glocks it is but they definitely hard they definitely pressure so shout out to you my boy ziggy let's move on to the next next up we got my boy ricky allen he has a cz scorpion evo sbr i'm gonna give it a nine out of ten and i'm a cop just because it's plain and simple let's move on to the next If you also do the carry conceal license, y'all need help with all license and all that shit to get them blicks legit, go hit him up. I'ma put his shit in the bio and I'ma also put it in the video, man. You really got that ice for real. I'm talking about real water. Y'all see my shit dancing. Water. And this ain't no fool shit. Solid background. Yup. So if y'all want that shit, go hit him up. He got watches, chains, custom grills, custom pendants, and he'll work with you. There's one thing about my nigga, he gonna work with you. Show. So y'all make sure y'all go tap in. Love my face, ain't y'all, I'm out this bitch. Bye, have a great time. It's your life, life, a cop it all if the price right. These vs ones fuck the night like demons in my eyesight. I done seen some niggas die twice. Ducking them people, this that mob life. Word 